हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम यू ऑल इन माई यूट्यूब चैनल एंजीनियरिंग गुरु ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इन दिस वीडियो यू विल लर्न सेफ्टी वाल टाइप हाई स्ट्रीम एंड लो वाटर सेफ्टी वाय यू कैन ऑल्सो जॉइन अस ऑन टेलीग्राम चैनल एंजीनियरिंग गुरु ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इन दिस वीडियो वी विल कवर हाई स्ट्रीम एंड लो वाटर सेफ्टी वाल कंस्ट्रक्शन वर्किंग यूजिस एंड फंक्शन नाउ वी विल सी वन बाय वन so this is the schematic diagram of high stream and low water safety valve we can see that this is lever l1 this is hinge stem out knife edge projection balance weight this is lever l2 weight w4 float w3 hinge wall roll wall seat v2 main wall v1 weight w1 now let's start with the construction it consists of two wall v1 and v2 of which wall v1 rest upon the wall seat and other hemispherical shape wall v2 is placed over v1 which act as wall seat of wall v2 so here this is the main wall v1 and this is the hemispherical wall v2 so wall v2 is placed over v1 and which act as wall seat for the wall v2 to maintain the desired pressure in the boiler it acts like a simple lever loaded safety valve the lever l1 is hinged on the one end and weight w1 is attached to the other end while v2 is loaded with weight w4 so here uh, this is the uh, lever 1 and hinge on the one end of the weight w1 so here Uh, this is the weight w1 and is attached to the other end valve v2 here this is the valve v2 is loaded with the weight w4 so this is w4 a pivot is placed on valve v1 which keeps it in a position under normal working pressure inside the boiler cell the lever l2 is hinged at the fulcrum p so uh, this is the lever l2 and this is the fulcrum point p one side of lever l2 is loaded by balance weight and other side carries a float immersed in the water so this is the lever l2 one side balance weight w2 and other side float w3 is immersed in the water the hemispherical valve v2 is connected with wall roll knife k provided on the lever l2 that is collar c on the wall roll under the normal pressure so here this is the point k knife edge and this is the point c collar so knife k provided on the lever l2 that is the collar c on the wall roll under the normal pressure so this is the construction of this safety valve now we will see the working of this safety valve when the pressure exceed the normal valve limit the valve v1 is lifted along with lever l1 and valve v2 this all safety valve will operate when the pressure exceed the design pressure or design limit or normal limit so the steam escape through the passage between the valve sheet and the valve v1 till the pressure become the normal here this is the valve v2 and valve v1 so if the pressure exceed so steam accept through this passage between the valve sheet and the valve v1 till pressure become the normal under the normal circumstances the weight w3 remain in water and complete the system is under balance when the water level falls below the certain levels the float weight 3 is uncovered so in so here uh, this is the a uh, float this is the float w3 so it remain in water complete in under the under balance but when the water level falls below the certain level the float is, is uncovered this cause an increase in its weight according to archimedes principles we state that the object lose weight in the water this swing the lever causing knife edge to push collar c which open the valve v2 thus allowing steam to accept between the valve v1 and v2 so here uh, this is the uh, collar point c 
this swing lever this is swing lever uh, causing the knife edge push the collar which open the valve we do so this hemispherical hemispherical valve will be open and thus allowing steam to accept escapes between the valve v1 and v2 escaping steam make loud noise as it passes through the narrow opening when the steam will pass here it will make sounds and this noise want the operator to start the feed pump to increase the level of water in the boiler this is the working of high steam and low water safety valve now we will see uh, the use of this safety valve this valve is used in cornish and lancashire boiler now see the function of this safety valve it is automatically blow off excess steam when the working pressure of the steam exceed normal pressure or when the water level in the boiler falls below the danger level so there are the four types of safety valve first deliberate safety valve second level loaded safety valve third spring loaded safety valve and fourth high steam and low water safety valve so in this video we covered high steam and low water safety valve construction working uses and function in earlier video we already cover uh, dead weight safety valve level loaded safety valve and spring loaded safety valve so if you find my video very helpful you can like comment share and subscribe my youtube channel you can also follow us on telegram channel engineering guru 2020 so now important question for university exam explain very briefly the function of flowing mountings high steam and low water safety valve so question may be asked like with the near sketch explain the construction and working of high steam and low water safety valve so this is the end of this video lecture stay on this channel next video will be come for the subject basic mechanical engineering thank you